Hi YouTube. I'm gonna start this video by saying something that I've said a few times in previous videos, which is that I've been riding bikes for 10 years. I say this because that means that I've ridden a lot of different types of bikes, I've used a lot of different products, and I've tried basically a lot of things while riding bikes, which I think gives me a little bit of credibility in stating the opinions that I state. Today I'm gonna review Far Sports, the Chinese wheels that I've been riding. I've been riding these on my road bike for about 1400 kilometers now, and I just got a new pair for the gravel bike. These are the ones that I'm riding on the road bike. They're 50 millimeter deep carbon wheels. And then these are the new ones I just ordered for the gravel bike. These are 650B, also carbon wheels. So a little bit of background. I've been using Zip 303 wheels for over a year. I've tried Zip, of course, Mavic, Fulcrum, FSA, so many different types of brands. This is the first time that I'm riding off-brand wheels. A little bit of background that I found online, Far Sports was founded in 2008 and is based in China. Far Sports focuses mainly on developing and manufacturing road, gravel, track, and mountain bike wheels with all kinds of different price ranges. Something that I found out today that I didn't know and I think is pretty cool and I didn't memorize because it's a number, but Far Sports meets and exceeds the ISO 4210 standards and are UCI approved. So that's a pretty big deal, which means these wheels are technically allowed to race the Tour de France. So they're, they meet the highest standards is what it means. And so now for my personal experience. A close friend of mine has been riding these wheels for years. He has really good things to say about them. And so now that I was finishing two bike builds and was looking for some cheaper wheels of very high quality, I too decided to go with them. I didn't go to Far Sports online. I went directly to one of their representatives which meant more personal communication and it meant that and I think it meant that I could customize the wheels a little bit more if you'd like this contact please let me know I don't want to share it out into the world on YouTube and that's my first point in reviewing Far Sports their communication their customer support is amazing I asked a lot of questions especially because when I started talking to them I wasn't sure if I was even going to buy a pair of wheels so I asked all different types of questions things that I didn't even actually know if I wanted. Another thing that surprised me was that after I received the wheels, I received an email from them saying that they were checking the tracking and that I received the wheels and they were wondering if I did receive them. So basically that means that they want to make sure that you get the wheels, which is important when they're sending something from China to, in my case, the US. Even though it's far, the shipping is free and I did not have to pay customs when the wheels enter the US. So that's a huge plus. Even though these are off-brand or no-brand or whatever you want to call it wheels, they do have a two-year guarantee and crash replacement policy at a 35% discount of the original price, which is already low comparing to other brands. Now, I've ridden a lot of different brands of wheels before, like I said, but I'm not the best at being specific on how the wheels are good or bad. What I know is that these wheels do feel responsive and stiff, which is something most people look forward to. But apart from that, I can't give you much of an honest review because I'm not a scientist. I just know that they feel good and I'm happy with them. Little disclaimer, I paid full price for the wheels. Far Sports did not give me a discount. I just thought I'd share because I think everyone should get on this bandwagon. There's no reason for you to be paying 
to three times as much the price for something as good, in my opinion. So my communication with them went back and forth and I asked for a lot of options when buying these 700C disc wheels. I asked for, again, 700C carbon disc wheels between 50 and 60 millimeter depth. This is what they told me, that they could offer two different types of hubs, the DT Swiss DT180, which would mean that the wheel set would weigh in at 1,210 grams, and the wheel set would cost 1,386 US dollars. The other option for the hubs were the DT Swiss DT240, which would mean that the wheel set would weigh 1,220 grams, and the cost would be 1,030 US dollars. So after being given those two options, I chose the DT240 just to go with the cheapest option, knowing that those are very good hubs. And then they offered me three different types of wheels, taking into consideration that I wanted something between 50 and 60 millimeters of depth. The first one was 50 millimeter deep, 26 millimeter wide, 19 millimeter internal width, and weighing at 1,370 grams. This means that these wheels would be focused more towards road racing, skinny tires, fast racing basically. And in the end, that's what I ended up going with. But they also offer two more options. One being also 50 millimeters deep, 30 millimeters wide, 24 millimeters internal width, and weighing at 1,380 grams. So basically 10 more grams, but you get a little bit of a wider bed for bigger tires if you're trying to do gravel racing or something that would require a little bit more ease when mounting those tires and also more comfort while riding. I have installed 35 millimeter gravel tires on these wheels and they worked fine, but ideally you would want that little bit of a wider bed. And finally, the last option that they offered for my specific re requests were 58 millimeter deep wheels, so a little bit deeper, 28 millimeter wide, 21 millimeter internal width, and these would weigh at 1450 grams. So a little bit heavier, a little bit deeper, more aerodynamic, but also kind of an in-between of the previous two uh, rim beds. Like I said, I ended up choosing the first one, and here are the specs of this specific pair of wheels. They are 700C disc, 50 millimeter deep wheels. The bed measures to 26 millimeters wide, and the internal uh, measurement of the bed is 19 millimeters. It has 24 spokes. It is the color is black matte and I've asked for it to have no branding So it's just plain black. The rims are hooked versus being hookless. It comes with black sapim or sapim, don't know how to say that alloy external nipples. It's tubeless ready and it comes with also black sapim CX ray spokes. So the spokes and the nipples or and the hubs like we established before are of internationally recognized brands, which adds even more credibility to the wheels. So that's the 700C, um, what I'm calling Criterium racing wheels that, I've, that I'll be using for the coming Criterium season. Then I also wanted to talk about the 650B pair that we just ordered. We haven't used it yet, but the specs of these wheels that I have right here are as follows. So they're 650B, disc wheels 40 millimeter deep so a little bit less deep than those other wheels the bed is 30 millimeters wide and the internal measurement is 24 millimeters they also have 24 spokes and the color is the same it's matte black no branding they basically look like the same pair of wheels the spokes and the nipples are the same as the previous wheel set the difference is that these are hookless rims while the other ones were hooked. And so that's pretty much it. That's been my experience with Far Sports so far. I will keep in touch with them. I will give them feedback. I will probably order more wheels in the future. Something that I also wanted to mention that I thought was pretty cool was when I made the payment, which by the way, they give you two options. You can do a bank transfer, in which case you pay exactly what they told you you'd pay, or you can pay through their Alibaba store, which requires that you pay a fee. So once you do that payment, they go and assemble the wheels. Then they actually take some pictures and send them to you before they ship them. Then you say cool or don't say anything. They ship them to you, they give you the tracking number. And then like I mentioned before, they'll keep in touch and uh, make sure that you receive them. And that's pretty much it. So I have about 1400 kilometers worth of experience on these wheels 
that experience has been pretty good. I will start writing these gravel wheels as well and hopefully we'll do a more in-depth review of how I felt writing Far Sports wheels. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Subscribe to the channel so that I can keep making cool videos like this. Cool in my opinion. Um, and actually I just started a Patreon page because I really am making a big effort to make this my full-time thing and that would help a lot if uh, any of you guys that believe in what I'm doing uh, could help support um, the project monthly. A little intermission here just to say that if you guys can pledge 10 or more dollars to my Patreon, you actually get one of these cool t-shirts, soft power t-shirts that uh, Patreon is actually helping make. So um, head on over to my Patreon and get one of these cool tees. So thank you, see you guys on the next video.